Top Gun, Maverick is now a blockbuster action movie. The critics and the audience are loving it. The movie even managed to get break Memorial Day records and got a five-minute standing at the Cannes Film Festival. Tom Cruise came back after 36 years to reprise his role as Pete Maverick Mitchell, a U.S. Navy pilot. And this got his first $100 million opening weekend. The movie managed $124 in the first three days, according to Paramount Pictures. The director, Joe Kosinski, managed to recreate the authentic magic of the previous film. But in the upcoming Top Gun movies, we might not see Tom Cruise as the lead in an interview with Polygon. Joe Kosinski talked about his latest film. Upon being asked how did he pitch the idea to Tom Cruise and what convinced him, he answered, Well, I worked with Tom, and I knew to start with character and emotion. I just pitched this idea of Bradley Bradshaw growing up to become a naval aviator, and him and Maverick having this fractured relationship that had never been repaired. With Maverick getting called back to train this group of students to go on a mission that he knows is very, very dangerous. He further added, the conflict the difference between being an aviator who goes in and risks his own life, and someone who's in a more senior position that has to send others in to risk their lives. I talked to some Navy admirals who talked about that difference. It's a different sort of pressure, it's almost harder to send others in rather than go yourself. And to me, it felt like that leveraged the emotion of the past film and those relationships that we all love but took it in a new direction. So that's where I started. The director shared that it was the emotional conflict in the story that convinced Tom Cruise to return. And the movie became his first $100 million opening films. In fact, it has the fourth biggest opening in the COVID-19 era. But now it seems that we would not see the actor in the lead role of another Top Gun movie, though the director did not specify it. It seems that the torch would now be passed down to Miles Teller. They wanted him to play an important role so that they can pass down the torch. Also, Tom Cruise is now 58 and would not want to do such a movie in the future. So if there is a Top Gun 3, we can see Miles Teller as the lead.